Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm Sally Jack's TV Mom. Today is a bit of a is a bit of a weird video because um, obviously during lockdown, uh, everybody's ordering online for everything. So, and I tend to head to. He's hanging around. He wants to show you a couple of things that he's got in this in this bundle. Um, I wanted to show you some really weird and crazy things that we've actually ordered on Amazon. You can get these at Tesco. <laughs> The winders, he lacks his winders. He got them yesterday. Winders from Tesco's. Right, so I'm going to show you some eight things that I've bought from Amazon that's really weird. And we've so, Frankie Jack, do you want to start off with yours first? Right, come on then. Have you whacked? Oh, he's whacked his mouth. He's just gone like that on his clothes. Are you going to show them the most exciting one so far? Wow, it's amazing. So yeah, this is an Amazon delivery. That's what I mean. It's very weird, is this vlog, for what we bought. So we bought wheels and we've also bought uh, the rods for the wheels to go on. So what is that going to be used for, Frankie Jack? The Coke and Mintos. So we're doing a Coca-Cola and Mintos challenge. Don't know whether you've ever seen this on YouTube. We are going to be doing this, um, so we are going to show you. And we're putting Mintos into Coca-Cola and let's see how it shoots. We can't do it today because the weather is absolutely disgusting outside. But apparently it's supposed to be dry tomorrow, so we're meant to be doing it tomorrow. Hey, hey, hey. We're really excited about doing that tomorrow. What else have you got as well? Woo! What else have you got? Show them. So he's got a new money box. He likes smashable money boxes. And we couldn't find one, really. When you're in the shops, you can find all sorts of designs. Unfortunately, online, um, that, that was the only one, really, that was suitable for him, saying holiday funds. I wanted to get one that was a bit more sort of boyish. But that's what I got. But we're doing his, his room up as well, and it's going to be like a, a seaside um, uh, sort of theme. So that'll go well in there. That's his smashable money box. I've got a blood pressure monitor. Um, so I've got this to take my blood pressure um, to see how it is. So you're meant to do it um, three, I think it's three times a day or even twice a day, morning and night. And you're meant to take it three times in the morning, three times at night and take the average of what you've got. So the doctors were going to lend me one because unfortunately last time I had my blood pressure read, first time ever it came up because I've always got low blood pressure. For some reason my blood pressure came up um, just bordering on high. Uh, so they wanted to lend me one. So I said, oh, instead of doing that one, I'll just buy my own. And it was, I think, about £16 on Amazon. Because the thing is, you've always got it, haven't you, for the future rather than borrowing one. And also in these times, you don't know who's, who's had it and who's used it. That's his daddy's. That's Gary's, isn't it? That's mm -hmm. Daddy's from from the, the um, that's Gary's from, so it's the same as his. So that's why we got that one because that was the kind of only one that was a kiddie one. Then we've also got this is not exciting. Um, don't know whether you use this, but um, obviously I do clean a lot, and uh, we use the dish matics, and I absolutely love these. So I've been using these for years. So they're a handle, and you put the sponge on the end, and then you put the washing up liquid inside, and then as you clean, it comes out. So I noticed the other day that, that we were short in what we what I call the utility room which we use for the for the dogs and um, we used to be cats obviously when we had them um so we bought some more of those and Gary got an absolute shed load um from Amazon so we got a great big massive box delivered then I've also got some uh, bits and pieces because we're going to make some brownies and we're also going to make some cheesecake. But we're what? going to do oh brownies. Oh, but they're actually going to be sugar free because um, I feel that uh, I've never really baked before until having Frankie Jack, um, and he absolutely loves it, and we love doing all that together. Last night we did cowabunga chicken, which was really exciting. You get raw chicken. Yeah. You get your favourite chips. Crisps. Crisps. <laughs> crisps. And smash them up. And then you get some eggs. You take them the chicken. You take the chicken, mix it up. So twist the chicken around. In the flour. In the flour. And then put the chicken in the eggs. And then you put the crisps. <sighs> On the chicken because it it sticks, st to it. it sticks to it. And it stuck to all our fingers. Mummy had little lumps on the end of her fingers, didn't she? And they tasted absolutely delicious. It's called Cowabunga Chicken and Jack does it at um, Ideal World. It's a great one. So I've gone for natural sugar alternative. Um, so I'm trying to find the natural as possible because obviously... Um, 
uh, aspartame and uh, obviously there's a bit of a thing about artificial sugar isn't it that's not actually that good for you so I've gone for a real sort and of these, uh, baking these, uh, one there's six in a packet so I've gone for a real baking one that's that's kind of a keto led one so I've gone for that then I've ordered because the cheesecake the bottom of it is made with almond flour so I've gone for I think it's a kilo of that uh, because you can't get that in any supermarkets we had a look online uh, then I've also gone for uh, Seven Hills Whole Foods, that's cacao powder, so that's your um, chocolate uh, that goes in for our chocolate brownies. And I've also ordered these, which are the little, so I'm actually going to be making my own candles. And I keep saying this, I keep saying that I'm going to do a vlog. And oh my gosh, I bet it's been a year since I said it to you, isn't it? Or it goes over the top and one of your wicks goes through there. And um, and that keeps the wick in place for when you pour the wax in. So I ordered um, some of those in metal. And then I also ordered a three kilogram. This was expensive, actually. This was £20. I know, I was really shocked at this. This um, is a three kilogram uh, jug to be able to melt your wax in. Because I've got that much wax now from old candles. But don't worry, I'm going to do a new vlog on this so you can follow it. Um, that I'm actually going to try and make my own candles. Because candles can be actually very expensive can't they and we burn them all the time when we're in at night and even though we're obviously going to eventually open back up to be able to go out I still think we're going to enjoy our movie night so those are my weird and wonderful things that I bought yes on a strange Amazon uh, delivery I hope you enjoyed and um, don't forget to give us a thumbs up please and don't forget to subscribe for free as well love to have you part of our YouTube family I'll see you on the next vlog and I'm hoping I'm going to get this one done as soon as possible this candle making I might even try and do it today so I'm, I might be in the same clothes um, love you lots as always, and I'll see you later.